Hello everyone. So it's almost the end of March and I thought I would sneak in one more March and Tosh video. So right here I have the LC2 computer that I recently recapped. Uh, you can see my previous video on the process. And I have it running over here. And I'm kind of curious, does anyone know why it looks a little bit different and a little bit peculiar? Any ideas? I mean, it looks like a Macintosh, but you might spot some differences. Well, it turns out that this isn't the Macintosh OS at all. Um, this LC2 actually has an Apple IIe card, and I'm running this uh, desktop environment I found out about called Apple II Desktop. Uh, there's a website you can go to, it's a2desktop.com, and basically they have the history of this desktop environment that was created for the Apple II computer. And that's what I have running on, on this uh, LC2. So this, this machine has an emulation, or uh, has the Apple IIe card, and I loaded up uh, the Apple II desktop. And it's kind of neat. It has a pretty much some of the basic things that you might find in a, a regular Macintosh. Um, this was uh, developed by a, a French company uh, called Version Soft. Uh, initially, it was called Mouse Desk. Uh, and Apple uh, briefly licensed it for use in their upcoming 2GS computer which of course later uh, they developed their own software for, but initially it used this very neat uh, emulated, uh, not emulated, but it used this very neat uh, desktop environment for the Apple II. Um, if I go over here under the Apple menu, I can actually get information about the system and you can see it's actually running on ProDOS on the Apple IIe option card. It has some cool little things like screen savers. Uh, here's my favorite. It's the flying toasters. There's also a matrix screensaver. Uh, this was obviously developed after the fact, um, but it's, it's kind of cool. Uh, there's a melting screensaver. It just kind of melts the screen. Let's see what else we have. Um, we got a calculator. There's a calculator. Uh, just to show you here that I am running on the Apple IIe card, you can see here that now I'm back into the Macintosh environment. Uh, there are a couple of things I had to do. I had to set the display to monochrome, and I also set the speed to fast, just to give it better performance. Um, but let's continue. We'll go back to the Apple IIe environment. Now, unfortunately, there's not very, there's not many apps at all uh, for uh, this environment, so I guess it was a pretty short-lived thing, but. It's still pretty cool that uh, there was a desktop environment for the Apple IIe. So 
So that's what I wanted to share with you. I'm happy uh, Mar Marchintosh.